Okay, so what we're going to do today is we're doing exterior angles of triangles. So if we think of a triangle, these purple angles here are all interior angles, okay, meaning they're inside the shape, okay. This green angle here is what we call an exterior angle because it's on the outside of the shape. So today we're going to be solving problems involving exterior angles. All right, so for this question, we've got two unknown angles. We've got X and we've got Y. Now, there's a few different ways that we can work these out. However, the first thing I want to point out is that this is a straight angle. And a straight angle adds up to 180 degrees. Okay, if you want to know more about angles, we've got another video about angles. So to get X, I'm going to go 180 minus 112, okay? Because X plus 112 will give me 180. I can do that on my calculator and that's going to be 68 degrees, okay? So I'm going to lightly write that in here in green. All right, so now I can use my knowledge of X and the given angle to find Y. So we learned before that there's 180 degrees in every triangle. So I'm going to take away this and take away this to find out what Y is. And that's going to leave me with 36 degrees. Now, there's another way that we can check to see if we've done this right, because these two interior angles should add to that exterior angle. OK, so not including the one that touches it. The ones that aren't touching the exterior angle should add to give me that. And that means I should go 76 plus 36 should give me 112. And I know that 76 and 36 do add up to 112. All right, so for this question, we're trying to find B. And you can see that these are both the same angle. Okay, so the first thing we need to do is use our knowledge of this straight angle to find the unknown. So we're going to go 180 minus 116. And that equals 64 degrees and I'm going to write that here so we don't forget. Now 180 minus 64 is going to give us 116 degrees again. Okay so that kind of goes back to my point about the two angles that aren't touching the exterior angle add up to that exterior angle. And that's proven here, this and this equal this. Okay, so really what I could have done to start off with is I could have just gone 116 degrees divided by two. Now I'm dividing it by two because together these are 116 and I know that they're both exactly the same because they've both got the same letter. So 116, if we halve that, then we're going to get 58 degrees. Okay, so that means that B equals 58 degrees. So we can use our knowledge of interior angles, exterior angles, and triangles to be able to solve and find unknown angles.